for me, from my experience, atheism is, you know, practically denying God. I was not conditioned as an atheist growing up because I grew up in an Anglican household. Um, I, I did not grow up in a place where people were outwardly denying God until 2001 um, when my father passed away um, in an accident. This is when a crisis moment comes up the things underneath the surface that are strongest come to the surface. I start to contemplate suicide. Um, I start to get these thoughts and these images of me killing myself. I was a very avid listener of rock music, so and not even just like normal rock, I used to listen to hard rock, metal mm. rock, all, all that demonic stuff, actually. You know, it has to be external. And often if it's external, it's, it's a demon, you know? And of course, science, science, natural sciences do not believe in demons yeah and yet there's a lot of evidence when you look at schizophrenics you know people who have conversations with other entities and those entities know things about them that they couldn't or know things about other people you know that they couldn't have known i wasn't saying there's no god i was denying there's a god there's a man there are some scientists who calculated the probability of uh, of of um random Random, randomness creating the order that we see. Mm. And it's almost zero. You need faith to be an atheist. You actually need more faith to be an atheist. Be an atheist. Because you have to go against all common sense. Mm. Yeah. I don't have a clear memory of the transition, but at some point I'm standing, listening to this song, and I'm weeping. Um, and in the midst of that weeping, um, something happens. Um, an electric bolt hits my hands. A bolt of electricity oh, yeah. hits my hand. And it's so significant that I stop what I'm doing. I pull out my earphones. I sit on my bed and I look at my hands and I'm asking, what just happened? Mm. Um, and I couldn't explain it. I look up at the light bulb and you know my scientific mind is thinking maybe this was static electricity because the bulb is too high for me to reach it. So I couldn't have gotten touched it yeah um at the same time it doesn't make sense that those be yellow bulbs you know have static electricity yeah um but then i know what i felt i felt this bolt oh. move through my hands my uncle told me men don't cry and i didn't cry and for many years i didn't cry that encounter i had with god was one of the first times that i actually right. properly cried in my experience um when I lost my dad, I remember very clearly two things. One was the statement, God giveth, God taketh away. I don't know it has to be giveth. 